Traders have specific requirements for their order routing interfaces. The DOM Trader preferences enable you to customize your DOM Trader with the features and functionality you want. Welcome to an overview of the CQG DOM Trader Preferences tutorial. This video walks you through configuring features and functionality of your DOM Trader. You access the DOM Trader Preferences page by clicking Setup and then selecting Trading Preferences. You see a list of preferences by group characteristics available, including Display, Notifications, Risk, Limits and Stops, Smart Orders, and Strategy Orders. We'll start with the Display Preferences. Select one of the eight color schemes. You can see what each theme looks like by selecting it and referring to the preview grid. Some themes have different colors for above and below the current inside market. You can arrange the column order by clicking the arrow buttons. In this group of choices, you select the data to be displayed in the columns of the price ladder. You can include elements such as the volume of the last trade, the trade sequence, highlight average fill price, displaying watermarks, choose to color the buy and sell columns, display depth of market volume details, and add a column of the Greeks for options trading. Under this column, you have a wide range of features and functionality. You can elect to have the scale respond to price movement or be dynamic with price movement to show the split market compression tool, to turn on fast click mode, to enable keyboard trading, and turn on sweep mode. Select these checkboxes to display buy, sell market, inside market, order size, and cancel buttons on the DOM trader. Check this box to display the day's cumulative traded volume. The third column over offers more functionality as well as features you can decide to display. Here you can enable the heads up display for enhanced features trading from the DOM trader. Select Enable Manual Fills for entering orders into your account not executed via the CQG Gateway. Choose to highlight the prices in the price scale. Opt to have the price scale in the DOM Trader not reset after you place an order. Choose here to display open trade equity with or without profits and losses, as well as how to calculate open trade equity. Elect to show combined net positions for relative commodities, such as the large S&P contract with the E-mini S&P contract. Spread traders can show synthetic positions for strategies, such as calendar spreads. Option traders can select which model to use for calculating the Greeks. Choose the look using one of three styles of your buttons on the DOM trader. Select whether to replace the size of the order when you click the Order Size button on the DOM Trader or to increase or decrease the size. Here, decide what colors to use on the DOM Trader to highlight the Buy and Sell columns and to highlight the Best Bid and Best Ask Order volume. This concludes Part 1 of an overview of the CQG DOM Trader Preferences. Thank you.